I'm Amanda Taylor with Entertainment Weekly, and we are about to go talk to the cast and crew of the Mortal Instruments City of Bones. This film has romance, demon slaying, and vampires. What more could you want? The movie has, obviously, it's, it's a fantasy world, and there are a lot of visual challenges. Was there something that, um, when you read the script, you were particularly anticipating, whether you were nervous or very excited about a certain scene? Well, I think the, um, the demons are hard to figure out, so I, I was inspired by, uh, by The Exorcist which I think was a great way to show a possessed human being. And so I kind of did that approach, made sure that I had actors in all the parts and, and had them be possessed instead of turning them into full CG creatures. One of the major um, themes of the movie is that she has a, a mother who has kept a large secret from her. So have your parents ever kept a big secret from you or, or kind of dropped a bomb on you that you were like, oh no? <laughs> um, I know, like Clary's mom, Jocelyn, she would want to protect me from things and, and would keep certain things maybe away from me until I was old enough to handle them. You know, like things about, um, I don't know, like our family or something, you know, family history or whatever it is that maybe I wasn't, wouldn't be able to deal with when I was younger, but like waited till I was older. I can't think of something specific, but I know that the reasoning would probably be the same as Jocelyn to like protect me. So the, probably the most emotional scene from the book at least um, is the scene in the greenhouse. It's a good scene for, for Jamie uh, or uh, for Jace to see what actually makes him tick. When Lily and Jamie kiss, they just had to remind them that this is the first time the characters are kissing. So, you know, we did a few more takes where it was a little more, <laughs> you know, after a few takes, you kind of forget that this is their first kiss. So that was uh, one of those things that we had to go, no, 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 every kiss is the first kiss. <laughs> for Jason, for me personally, you know, th there's the greenhouse scene. Um, and that's where Jace opens up to Clary and like shows her his vulnerable side and tells her about his life and he doesn't really do that with a lot of people and then obviously there's the kiss but like for me it was about showing the vulnerability. I know that your character Clary is a shadow hunter but if you had to go on the other side and you had to choose which downworlder like would you be a vampire, werewolf, what would be your choice? Ooh, um... I kind of like the whole vampire thing. Um, the ones in this movie really know how to fight well. They are creatures of the night, and I'm like, I'm a big night person as well. Are you, a, do you consider yourself a shadow hunter, or, or are you more of a downworlder? Uh, I like the werewolves. I think uh, me and Aiden Turner would hang out and do, have some fun, yes. So what would you say you are? Are you more of a Jace, or are you more of a Clary when it comes to decision making? I'm a mixture between the two. I love spontaneity, but not on a Sunday. <laughs>